And welcome back to the Dog Father's Toys. Uh, today be the first for me looking at a G.I. Joe action figure. Uh, I never really was into the G.I. Joe when they first came out in the mid 80s because I was about out of collecting then but I did collect only two characters and that was Snake Eyes and Shipwreck Shipwreck being a Navy man and coming from a house where where my grandfather and my father served in the Navy I chose uh, shipwreck so let's open this up and see what's in it but, but before we go any further with the video let's get this out of the way please subscribe to the channel leave a comment tell me what your favorite G.I. Joe was uh, big one the thumbs up and notification bell so with that out of the way let's unbox this and see what you get still not happy with the Hasbro t boxing but done okay pull that out and that whatever that's in there okay What the heck? Uh, one day, they, uh, one thing you won't sh sh steal this from the store. Alrighty. He's out of the box. He stands up roughly six. Oh, stands roughly six inches tall. He's got hooks, a holster, two holsters. A removable hat. Put the hat back on them. Looks like something scary. But and it comes with this like foot locker. Reminds me of the Indiana Jones collection. That's empty. Oh, okay, here's 
You can take his hat off and put on his toupee. Now the one thing I do will say, uh, another reason why I like Shipwreck is because he looks like the original G.I. Joe's with the beard and the So he's the closest of the, uh, that king, oh, what the heck, how you put it. The closest you want to get, and here's him with his guns. Uh, this is a, looks like a pistol. Let's see, I guess you can put the pistol in that. And then you got this here hook. And then you got this other forty five. that go check the box out here okay Joe's that came with a pet and I have no idea where he goes okay the instructions <laughs> okay Look at the box again. Looks like uh, the, the parish name is Polly. Those who want to. Okay, there's a little hole for Polly. set he's got his bird he's got his two pistols his rope his hook and he's ready for action on the ocean Like I said, he's one of the one of the two I only collected. Well, I should say three. I did like Cobra Commander. Uh, only thing I was mad about he was not in the neither one of the GI Joe movies. And, uh, but, uh, but he was, in, he did have a toy from the toy line for the movie he, where he wore a, a complete black suit, 
but that's the closest he got to the movie. So, yeah, I picked him up. I usually don't p pick up G.I. Joe's at Walmart, but I seen it was shipwreck, and I said, what the heck? I mean, I ain't bought a G.I. Joe in years. So, that's Shipwreck from G.I. Joe Classified Series from Hasbro. I like that picture there. Looks like he's going nuts. And you got this thing on the side here you could... Then on the back, it just I don't, I don't even see an age requirement on it. El attention no danger. I shouldn't be. Oh, there it is. Not recommended for kids from zero to three. That means only one of my grandkids would be able to play with it. Because he's 12. And he wouldn't play with it if his life depended on it. And there you show, they, like I said, on the back you see what it comes with. What he looks like with the hairpiece. And Polly. Like I said, he is one of the few that had uh, animals that came with it. I think the other one was Snake Eye, who had a wolf, and uh, I think one more. I can't remember who it was now. <coughs> so that's that. So. In the comments, tell me if you you were a shipwreck, uh, sh yeah, shipwreck fan, and tell me what you think. So until the next video, I'll see you out there, yo, Joe. That's stupid, but I'll see you out there. Bye-bye. <laughs>